Greetings family, I am here with Sarah Shamsafari, a creative in so many ways. She's a singer-songwriter, she's a photographer, she's a stylist, she's an art director, the list goes on. Now what we're going to focus on today, she's going to tell us her truth, her story, her journey. Then we're going to talk about a fantastic exhibition which is still on, but we would appreciate coming down, having a look and leaving your comments in her book. So, Sarah, tell us about yourself. Hi Slane, good to see you again. Um, my name is Sarah Shantavari. Um I'm an artist, um, mainly known for my photography work, but also um, I, I do music as Slane said, and I also paint as well. Um, for the past couple of years I've really focused on using the camera um, to elevate and um, empower people but, and also to you know put the spotlight on uh, people who may have been marginalized um, in society and, and celebrating their beauty um, celebrating the uncelebrated really um, and so I've had like over the past couple of years I've had a series of different um, exhibitions you know, in, in various different places. Uh, one of them was called uh, Beauty Untold, which is about the uncelebrated beauty that exists in everyday people and situations, um, which debuted at the Topshop flagship store in Oxford Circus. Um, then we had, we also had Fathers, Brothers and Sons, which was a, a homage to men of ethnic minority backgrounds. And uh, we also um, had Love is Change, which was about love, um, love being a constant throughout all um, the social, economic, and uh, political up upheavals of, of the current time, that love is, is a constant, um, but also, also a driver of change. Um, so over the past, a uh, couple of years, I mean over this past year actually, I and mean, all of those shows were, were solo shows, um, but over the past year the uh, parts of those bodies of works have been exhibited in uh, Paris, at Pierre Cardin, in uh, New York, and in Hong Kong, and that takes us to December now, here and now. Um, to this show, Britain Retold, A Portrait of London, which is, which is in City Hall, and it's going on until uh, January the 4th, um, and it's my first uh, solo show of the year, and it's all about um, the idea of uh, the multi-communities in London redefining um, the idea of, of what it means to be British, particularly in London, a place where 50% um, of um, the UK's black and ethnic minority community live, um, also, you know, where three, you know, over 300 languages are spoken, um, you know, it's, it's a very exciting place, and it's, it's kind of, we're kind of putting focus, not exclusive focus, but focus on um, the multi-communities in London and their definition or redefinition of what it means to be British um, in London now. Um, and the idea is that that can also, that we can move towards a, a new definition that includes the, the, the tradition, that includes the old, that includes what we know as being British, but also leaves room um, for the new as well, since, um, since people from these communities contribute to um, the UK uh, e economically, but also to um, the, the, the richness and the vibrance of, of the UK and London in particular, which makes it a, a, you know, truly a centre of the world. So that's what Britain Retold is about. 